On October 13, 2024, a historic event took place in Poland as American and Polish officials inaugurated a NATO Aegis Ashore missile defense base in Redzikowo. This development marks a significant step forward in regional and NATO security, especially given the ongoing conflict in Ukraine. Originally planned under the George W. Bush administration to counter potential threats from Iran, this base has now become a crucial defense asset against Russia, reflecting Poland's growing security concerns following Russia's invasion of Ukraine. The Aegis Ashore system, which powers the Redzikowo base, is designed to detect, track, and intercept ballistic missiles. Equipped with the an spy one radar, this advanced system provides continuous 360-degree surveillance, while the SM-3 interceptors destroy enemy missiles during their mid-flight phase, providing a robust defense against missile threats. Redzikowo now becomes the second ground-based installation in Europe to feature this system, joining Romania's Devesalu base, which has been operational since 2016. Poland's leaders, along with U.S. officials, hailed the base as a symbol of NATO's strengthened commitment to European security. Polish President Andrzej Duda emphasized that the base represents a shift away from Russia's sphere of influence. He said that the world would now see that Poland is no longer under Russian control. Defense Minister the Ladyshla Kosiniak Kamish called the base a milestone not just for Poland, but for NATO and the United States, especially given the current conflicts in Ukraine and the Middle East. This missile defense shield forms part of a broader NATO defense network, which includes U.S. Navy destroyers in Rota, Spain, and advanced radar systems in Turkey. These facilities work together to provide protection against short- and medium-range ballistic missile threats across Europe. However, Russia has strongly opposed the base, viewing it as a direct threat to its security. Kremlin spokesperson Dmitry Peskov argued that the real aim of the base is to contain Russia militarily, despite NATO's assurances that it is purely defensive. Moscow claims that the U.S. is using the Iranian missile threat as a pretext, and the expansion of NATO's military presence near Russia's borders is seen as a challenge to Russia's strategic capabilities. While the current Aegis Ashore system is calibrated to defend against threats from the Middle East, NATO is considering reconfiguring the radar to address potential Russian missile threats. Polish officials have expressed interest in expanding the base's capabilities to better address Eastern Europe's evolving security needs. Discussions with NATO and the United States are expected to explore these possibilities further. The opening of the Redzikowo base stands as a powerful symbol of the strong military partnership between Poland and the United States. This partnership is seen as vital to Poland's national defense and the broader stability of Europe. As tensions with Russia continue to grow, the base adds an important layer of defense for Poland and NATO, helping to ensure that the alliance remains united and resilient in the face of emerging challenges. In the end, the Redzikowo base reinforces NATO's commitment to the security of its member states and strengthens Poland's position as a key player in the defense of Europe. As NATO continues to adapt to new threats, the installation serves as a crucial part of the alliance's strategy to maintain regional stability and deter aggression from Russia. Thank you.